Hey everybody, Colleen here with Colleen Beauty and Fashion. So today is day 16 of Colleen's Christmas Countdown. Now, I have a confession to make. I did not put up a video yesterday, so I apologize to that, especially to my loyal subscribers who I appreciate so much. Thank you for being subscribers, and I'm sorry that I disappointed yesterday, but I just had such a crazy day. I work as a fundraiser, as many of you know who follow my channel, and we had a big event yesterday, and I thought I would be able to do something around that event, but I just got too busy and I forgot to vlog it. So there you go. So um, kind of a failure. But anyway, moving on, today is going to count as 15 and 16, and I have a new video for you. And I want to thank all the people who clicked on this thumbnail and thought, oh, they were interested in this topic of white jeans in the winter. So that's what we're going to talk about today. And if you like this video or if you liked one of my shorts and you came to this video and you poke around and you like my channel, please like and subscribe. We're still building our subscriber list and I'm so excited it's getting bigger all the time. So let's get into it. I'm going to do three looks with white jeans for the winter time. So these are my white jeans. These are the mom jeans from H&M and I bought them last summer and there was some controversy about white jeans back then, even in the summer. So I'm sure there'll be some controversy wearing them in the winter, but I think you can wear them all year round. It's part of my capsule wardrobe. And if you are shy about white jeans in the winter, maybe switch to black, but Honestly, I get so tired of black in the winter time and I'm a color person. You will know that if you follow my channel. I like bright colors and optimistic looks. So I love a classic black look, but I love a classic white look too. So let me go put on the first look for you. So here we go then with look number one. This is a neutral kind of look. Uh, so a neutral top has a little bit of white in it that ties it to the jeans. And I've also put on white trainers. So let me show you here. And I will put a cutaway as well of this look so you can see how it looks uh, from a longer perspective. But this is a super easy, super easy look, right? Now you could change it up by changing the footwear. So here I've got these neutral boots, which would dress it up a little bit more. But I think this is a great look just for being around the house or maybe going shopping or running errands. It's just a really easy look to wear. And instead of wearing blue jeans all the time, once in a while you can wear white jeans and change it up. So look number one. Now we're gonna go on to look number two, which is a little bit more elevated. And I'm thinking of it for a casual Friday at the office look. So for my second look, I'm starting with a black and white shirt. And you can see I've got it on with the mom jeans. I've got it kind of sort of tucked in at the back. Not really, but you could tuck it all the way in too. I put on a black belt and my vision for this was kind of for a casual Friday kind of a look. So I have on some black boots that I'll show you in the cutaway. But to make this a winter outfit to keep to make yourself warmer, I would put on a sweater. And for this one, I have a long cardigan in black. Not really a cardigan, it doesn't have any buttons, but let's slip this on. So as you can see in the cutaway, that just, I think a long black cardigan like this can really elevate an outfit. I think it's a really stylish piece. So, so there it is, look number two, and I think this would be really great. Like I said, for casual Friday at the office, or if you're going out and just doing a few things around a meeting somewhere and you didn't really need to dress up, this would be a great look. So here we go with look number three, which is playing on the classic blazer with jeans idea. So I have on a white rib shirt. This is kind of an all year round look, I think, but I do want to mention one thing about this houndstooth Chanel looking blazer. It does cut, right? Let me just fix this for a minute does cut right here which if your hips are really wide is not maybe the most flattering so the way to fix that is to switch up the blazer and get a little bit longer one so one minute 
By switching to a longer length blazer that goes over your hips, you can minimize that effect. Still the same concept, blazer over jeans. In this case, we've switched it up to white jeans and a black and plaid blazer. You could do any color blazer you want. Uh, anything will go with white. To make it more wintry looking, maybe black or, you know, brown, purple, something that's a little bit more wintry colored. And for Christmas season, maybe red, if you're that adventurous. You could also do a denim jacket it would work over this, although that really makes it much less formal than I was thinking about. But a denim jacket would work as well. So to make this look even more winter looking, I've switched now into a black turtleneck. And you can see how that just changes it all up all over again. But I haven't changed the boots. It's the same boots I was wearing with the other look as well. So there you have it. Three looks with white jeans for the winter. And I think you can wear your white jeans all year round. I think they're a staple in a capsule wardrobe. Not for everybody. I understand that. But I certainly enjoy mine and I wear them quite a bit. So here's Miss Bonnie to help me say goodbye today, like she always does. The cold weather is coming, so she's going to have to wear her parka when we go for walks next week. What do you think about that? Hmm? Yeah. Okay, you ready, baby? I'm going to say bye-bye now. Bye-bye, <gasps> people. Bye-bye, people. Bye-bye now. Okay. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching. Thanks so much for watching. Bye-bye now.